Alright guys, so I know I have not posted in a while, um, but I have been moving my room about, a little bit of rearranging some furniture, so that's what I've been doing. But we are going to be discussing, I know it's nearly over, but you know, never know for, for future purpose, the probably the three best um, CEO VIP works. That you can do through the interactive menu especially for this week or what's left of this week with them being double money um, first one we are going to go with these are in no particular order this is just the three better easiest ones that you can do on your own I'm going to start off with uh, fully loaded though uh, not on the list I'm not on this list but I will mention it you can do it on your own but it does take a while because you have to use the Runa 2000 and it doesn't have any rockets to boost with it's not that fast so it does take a while and the targets you have to kill are scattered throughout the map so yes you can do it on your own but it does take a while reasoning for it not being on this list now number one is probably the most popular is headhunter now this you get about at the moment with double money 42 43,000 um, for completion what you got to do is kill four targets that's it um, I did mention in a video a while back uh, these are very easy to do and even easier if you have a vehicle that flies and has rockets being uh, the Impressor Mark II, Deluxo, a Scramjet, even a Hydra with its explosive cannons would be very effective and the fact that it can hover as well um, but headhunter what you do is you get four targets that pop up on screen two of which are in a car two of them are on foot now these aren't spawned in random locations every time they are there's probably like two or three different locations that they will all spawn in yes they're different every time but they will only spawn in these three different sections um, so on foot ones, you, for example, you've got one at the pier, uh, one not knit, um, by one of the arcades, one of them by a little calf, I think, and I'm probably one somewhere else, but this is where they will pretty much always spawn. They will always spawn in these locations. Um, that's in the city. If you start Headhunter in uh, a bit north of the map, then you'll get different locations, but it's a bit easier doing them in the city because it's a bit more condensed. If you do it more up north, then you can have one in Sandy Shores and then another one on the other side of Mount Chiliad. So you've got to go quite a far distance. So I'd suggest you start these in the city because they're a bit more close together and a bit easier obviously ones on foot you can just boom straight one hit the ones in the cars however you hit them once with a rocket they're fine because they're in an armored vehicle you hit them twice then the vehicle will stop and the people will get out along one being the target three being people protecting the target now these people have very good aim so they will have no problems trying to kill you however what you want to do is you want to fire the two rockets to get it to stop and then as the door open, or as it stops fire the other rockets so by the time the person's out of the car um, they will die because I believe if they are in mid animation of getting out of the car they still count as being in the car so they won't die from the rocket because it's armoured but that is one of the easiest ones to do the next one is sightseer this is slightly easier because you haven't got to worry about people shooting at you again this is I think probably about 39 to 42 43,000 again um, basically you got four no three packages that you have to collect and these could be anywhere around the map however 
to get these packages you have to do three different things you have to do hack in on the phone so you start it up and then you'll be told use I think I can't remember what it's called um, but it's a little app on your phone and there will be one of three hacks that come up either the one with the four numbers that you have to line up the one with the letters that you again have to line up or the one with white bars that about six or seven white bars that go up and down on the phone screen and you have to select at the moment that the gap in between the two white lines line up with the red line obviously all of these hopefully if I remember the gameplay correctly uh, these will be on screen so you get an idea of which ones they are the first two you will recognize because they are pretty well used in the original contact missions um, so those ones are pretty simple because you'll recognize them and the red one the other one it's pretty simple all you got to do press A or X or whatever button it is that you've got on your controller or laptop PC whatever to select as soon as that gap hits the red line it pops up to the next one you should do it again um, once you've done these will come up by the way in any order like you could do one you could have the four numbers the letters and then the line and then you could do it after the cooldown you could have the line four numbers letters but it's going to be the them three types basically all you do is you start it up you do that first one you go get the package then once you've picked that up you go do the hack again you do the next one go get the package go pick it up next hack find it go pick up done um, easy five minutes each these no issues whatsoever no problems so that's and that's the second one and the third one is again pretty simple about I think 44,000 is hostile takeover now this one's slightly different because you can choose where to go so you start it up from the interactive menu again just bear in mind all of these you have to do in a CEO but you can do in an invite only session which makes it amazing but yeah hostile takeover um, bring up interactive menu to start it up and then you've got a choice if I can remember them rightly LSIA the atheist camp which I believe is the one in the mountains Merryweather base which is actually one of the docks and another one which I can't remember what it's called um, but anyway you select one of these I normally do the airport LSIA just because it's probably the easier one of the lot to be able to get to um, but basically all you do is you select the bit that you want to go to then you fly there or drive there or whatever then you have a package that you have to pick up but you have got people guarding it again being the use of a vehicle that can fly and has rockets is very useful now these as far as I'm aware because I've never had the issue uh, I believe you cannot destroy these packages because I've gone in guns blazing with rockets and the package has been fine but I would still probably be careful if you're using rockets only fire ones that will lock on just in case for some reason the package does explode but all you do is you go kill them pick up the package and then take it to wherever it is you gotta go you got you will get the police on you but you don't actually have to lose them you just gotta go to the place and then you lose the cops the moment you drop it off anyway but those are the three main well the three easiest um, VIP missions um, that you can do they are you know they're different they do take a bit of they take a bit a load off after doing God knows what else in the game after grinding however much you're grinding it's good it's a different kind of pace but there is cooldown after each one so just bear that in mind obviously you can do a lot more but most of them do involve having to be in a public session so you can do that but yeah but 
hopefully this was helpful for you guys. I know it's nearly the end of this event week, but it's still good information going on because you can still do these and they're still going to be the same. You just won't get as much money because they won't be double money. But if this was if this video was helpful in any way, then please obviously do leave a like if you do enjoy um, the well the content. Then again, leave a like. Leave a comment what your favourite VIP or MC club work mission is and why, because you never know, you might inspire someone else. Um, and with everything going on at the moment, we're a rock star involved in this apartment thingy. I'm not going to say the word because I don't want to have it for some reason taken down because I say a word that they are whatever. You know, you basically, you know what I'm talking about if you're a GTA player. You know exactly what I'm on about. But, yeah, anyway, and if you do go ahead and continue to enjoy any of the videos on the channel, then please do, do not forget to subscribe and click the notification bell to be notified on any future updates or videos that I unleash onto the channel. And I will see you all in the next one.